Sometimes I just wanna say fuck you But I can't right now cause I fuck with you When time fly by shit change But right now I'm feeling like I need space All right, y'all, so this is what the hair looks like. I've already worn this hair out and insert clips so you guys can see the beauty in this hair. Um, I went out with it and everything. If you follow me on Snapchat, then you've already seen this hair. If not, I'll go ahead and insert the clips because, honey, I've been really slaying this hair. But anyway, I had put this wig up for a minute and now it's back out. But I did have it straight and I feel like now I want to curl it. So I'm going to film me curling this wig just so y'all can see it because I know I never do anything on camera. But yeah, I've already put the wig on and I'm using Got To Be Glued. Me and Got To Be Glued have like a love-hate relationship. Sometimes it won't work, other times it don't want to work. I feel like today it wants to work. So yeah, this is how the hairline is. I'm also going to go ahead and insert clips of what the wig looked like originally because it was blonde. So this wig was blonde and I dyed it to this color. If I have um, the color, I know I used a door. I think it was something mint, mint green. It might have been mint green. I was saving the bottles for the longest time, but I don't know if they got thrown out or whatever the case may be. But I'll make sure I'll leave it in a screen um, if I don't have a picture of the bottle. But I used two bottles of that. I didn't mix it with conditioner. I just put it in the hair. Because you know how some people mix it with conditioner or like, um, or like the volume stuff, whatever it's called, to lighten the hair. I didn't do none of that. I just literally put this on and this is the color that it turned out to be. But like I said, this was blonde before I dyed it to this color. So I'll insert what the wig looked like originally and all that good stuff. But so real quick, I'm just going to give you the specs on this wig. This is the custom ombre color short straight full lace wig. And the item code is SC015. The hair type is 100% Indian virgin hair. The length is 12 inches. The hair color is a dark brown and a root which is a two and then um the rest of the hair is a uh, color 18 which is beige ash blonde the hair density is 130 percent the hairline is pre-plucked you guys um the lace color is light brown the cap construction is a cap three which is a glueless lace cap and the cap size is petite which if you have a smaller size head this would fit you great because it's definitely petite so you know it's fit my head real good boo so anyway let me stop rambling off at the mouth but this is what i'm using to protect the hair which is chi i use this on my real hair and i use it on my fake hair i just put like a dime size and then i just go throughout the hair and especially because it's dyed, you want to use a heat protectant just so the hair, you know, won't be damaged. And I really like this hair. Um, if it was probably any other hair, I probably wouldn't care, to be honest with you. But I really like this hair. So, yeah. I'm debating on if I'm going to give it away or not. Like, if I'm going to sell it. I don't know, y'all. I really like this hair. And I really like the color, too. So, we'll see. So anyway, after, you know, I saturate the hair, well not saturate, but you know, after I finish um, putting that on, I'm going to brush it just so I make sure it gets all them strands of hair, you feel me? I look like a cartoon character right now. So yes, honey, yes, y'all see that? Okay. So I'm using my flat arms to curl this hair on my straighteners to curl this hair and I have it on 400 degrees. 
so yeah um i think these is like hot tools golden hot something like that but i had these for a long time and they work so good so now i'm probably going to speed this up just because i'm just taking like sections oh i'm just taking sections and i'm just going to be curling my hair like going under i don't know i never can like i, I can't explain it but um but yeah so i'm gonna put this part back like this like I had to change my location you guys um, from the pink background because it was looking too aka ish shout out to all my aka girls but I just it just looked crazy um, so I had to move into my old background so yeah and it looks much better and you can definitely see the life in this wig okay guys so this is the end result and overall I'm definitely impressed with this wig y'all like when i say i don't feel like this hair was even ever like bleached or anything i feel like this hair was never even processed that's how good like the hair is holding up it definitely straightens really well and it definitely holds a curl really well as you can see and i'm just like in love with it it looks so natural the hair is so soft um i don't know why i'm out of breath <laughs> I've been out of breath in the last two videos, y'all. But I feel like this hair is holding up so beautifully. Like, I love when this hair out. It just is like a showstopper. Like, it definitely... So, this is what the part looks like. And like I said, you can part it all the way through. If you see a hump right here, it's only because my hair is not braided for a side part. Um, it's braided for a middle part, but it's laying still really flat. It just looks really, really natural. So guys, that's it for this video. If you have any questions, feel free to leave it in my comment section down below. And I'll see you in my next video. I love you guys.